So, Mira, you're here finally. We're still not handing you our friend. Perhaps this might change your mind. Wait, that's Moro's outfit. You didn't. Well, I didn't. One of my brainwashed slaves that have been mind controlled by entrance here killed him. Now, I suppose you hand over Wu and Joy now. You aren't on my watch. Da! Da! Hey, you don't do that to all my friends. Then you give me what I want. Oh, we are sure not. You'll have to get them from our cold, dead hand. Colin, you go and help Joy out. I'll handle these guys. Right, Zane. Zane, what are you doing? Wait, my brothers. Let me deal with these guys. I was still finally someone has decided to, to, to step up against Entrance, the master of hypnotism. I have your little girlfriend under my control, Nindroid. I have an entire army. I know. You're foolish to face us alone, Nindroid. We have entire armies. And you are just a pathetic, rusty, old Nindroid. You're wrong. I am made out of titanium, and thus cannot rust. And also, I do not- I am not just me. I have a sentinel. <laughs> ah, da, retreat! Retreat! Oh, uh, where are we? Huh? Zane? Pixel! Just so glad to have you back, finally. <laughs> Stupid ant tramps always running from a fight like a coward. Apprentice, let us kill these ninjas where they stand. Pixel, you get into the Sentinel. What? I said you get into the Sentinel. I'll allow you to pilot it. I'll go hold up Mira. We all by yourself? No. You'll get some help. Fine, I'll just destroy all of you all by myself. Apprentice, go destroy that sentinel. Okay, never mind, I didn't sign up, Brian. Hey, Mira. Hmm? You stay the hell away from my brothers. Hmm. Pathetic ninja. You were all trained by Master Wu. I thought he would have taught you better. Once I take your little purple friend's energy, I shall destroy your world 
and I am going to enjoy it. Hey, Mira! Whoa. It's me who you're after. You may have escaped death multiple times before, but you can never escape me. I visited countless Earths and killed variants of Ninja, but for some reason I was never able to kill a variant of you. Fine then, we shall deal with this my way. Master, I gotta go and help him. Kai. There, I got the dragon armor on. Yeah, like old times, master. Woo! <laughs> Woo. We meet at last. Face to face. Guy. Wait, that guy. The, the, the masked one with mirror. Is that Lloyd? Brother? Joy. Really is you. How did he? Well, you see, when the Bone King decimated your world and killed the ninja, your brother survived, and we thought he was quite useful, so we made him into a tool, a tool for our own bidding. Since you guys have a green ninja, we have one too. You know you're quite outnumbered, Mira. It's three against two. Or I should say, three against three. T Toa. Kai, don't hurt Lloyd. He may be brainwashed by the Time Breakers, but he's still my brother. Just don't hurt him. He's, he's still probably in there. Don't worry, Joy. I promise. I've seen exactly what you Time Breakers do. You destroy all, a lot of worlds. And when you threaten my world, that is where you've gone too far, old friend. Fine. If I kill you, then I will destroy Earth-1. And I am going to enjoy it very, very much. You may be stronger than me, Lloyd, but... I have much more experience than you. Fire! Ninja, go! You cannot win this time, Mira. I've survived you once before, and I can do it again. This time will be different. I was created with the DNA of of a, a lot of warrior species. <laughs> Get as new as to show you an exact of my abilities and with the DNA of, of the aliens that make up my being, I can go st grow stronger. <laughs> But I don't feel complete. The only way I can feel complete is if I take the DNA of of a dragon and Oni. Some of the most powerful entities of your world. I won't let you take Joy's power. Oh, I'm not after her powers. I'm only after her. Because I want to absorb her and make her part of me. So that way... I can have both the powers of an Oni and a dragon. The only way I can become more powerful than I ever have been before. 
and you are just in my way. Dad, Dad. Listen, Lloyd. I like. I know you're not my Lloyd. I don't want to fight you, okay? Dad. So this, this, this is what's like fighting Lloyd. He he would never like go out loud with me. Listen, Lloyd, I know exactly how you feel. You've been our leader for years. Lloyd, if you can hear me in there, I've been always trying to, for years, I've always, I've, I've always wanted to be like you. Either it's wanting to be the Green Ninja, or just wanting to be the leader of the team. I've always feared what exactly would happen if I was never popular. For years, I've always wanted to be the limelight, the main character in a story, but I've now realized that it was never my story to begin with. It was always yours. It was always going to be yours in the beginning and in the end. So please, Lloyd, just listen to me. For once. Huh? Lloyd? You. You witch. You let go of my sister. You. You bastards. Have killed my friends. Made me your slave. But most of all. You've threatened my sister. Leave. Leave now, while you still can. Ugh. <laughs> Mira, we must go now. We've lost the fight. <laughs> Mira, we must go. <laughs> I am not leaving until the deed is done. <laughs> In every single alternate reality, you are always meant to die in all of those. But you, here you are. You still live. Why? Why do you always have to live in this one and nowhere else? You die here and now, Wu. Colin! Colin? Why? I was always a fool to not help my brothers when they died. I failed to save my brothers, but I must save you, Wu. You have to live. <laughs> Elemental powers passed down through centuries. What a waste. Fine. No mask. No powers. Just our strength. It's over now, Fire Ninja. Once I absorb joy, they'll be unstoppable. T Wait. Take me instead. It's me that you wanted. You want to settle our debt for so long? I'm offering you the chance to do so. Absorb me and not joy. If that's what you want, old man, then you'll have it. <sighs> Master! No! <laughs> that old man sacrificing himself to finally complete me. And now, I am unstoppable. <sighs> wait, wait a minute. <sighs> the dragon blade. The blaze may have vengeance, then. 
I got it. Ta ta ha. You see, I no longer need you now. Thinks that old man sacrificing himself for me to absorb him. And now we shall fall by my hand. What the da? Cha cha. What the? How is this happening? Easy. The dragon blade is made of bench stone. And the elemental powers can be suppressed with Fenchstone. And since you're an elemental master, now that you absorbed Wu, now your powers don't work against Fenchstone. So you are now vulnerable since I stabbed you. De defeated by such puny little blade. Impossible. This cannot be possible. If I only I knew that absorbing the power of creation would be flawed. <laughs> Well, that was a load of pointless bullcrap. Lloyd, he's now vulnerable. Now's your chance. All right. Mira, huh? Brainwashed me. You made me. You killed my friends and everyone I'd known, and you had me under your control. You made me just a little slave of yours. Now, I shall destroy you! The, what? No, this, this can't be! No! No! It's all over. Finally. He's gone. But what cost? Greetings there, Ninjago citizens of Earth 15, 18, 19. We are gathered here today to remember the life of Colin. You see, Colin was someone who usually kept to himself. He never really expressed how he felt, but he did tell us that he had regret for not saving his friends when the Bone King arrived and ravaged Ninjago, and he sort of expressed that during the last days of his life. Colin may be gone, but he lives on through us, through our memories. He was always there to help us when we needed, and he always helped us fight the good fight, even though with the world told us not to, and when times seemed dreary, he was always there. He was always there to help us, aid us. He may be gone, but he will live on through us, the memories we had, and the sacrifice he made to save us. The sacrifice he made to save Ninjago from Mira. He will not be forgotten as we will never forget about him. There, we got some final touches on the bounty. I was able to help incorporate the Traveler's Teeth machine into the bounty's engine. Hopefully it can help us get back to our Earth. Well, yeah, I guess this is goodbye. We've been through a lot over these past few days. I know, Kai. I'll, I'll never forget about the times we had together. And I just wish I want to come with you guys back to Earth 1 and see exactly what's like. I wish, but... But Ninjago needs Ninja. And your Ninjago needs Ninja more than ever. Yeah, I guess you're right, Kai. I'm gonna miss you when you're gone. I will too. I... I just... There's a part of me that just wishes that I can stay with you. Yeah, but... But this isn't your reality. But just as you said... Ninjago needs ninja. And... Hopefully sometime I can help replicate that technology that Nia made and... And come and visit you sometime. Oh please, I'm gonna visit you first. 
enjoy. All right, everybody, let's hop aboard the Destiny's Bounty and head back to our Earth. Oh yeah, that's right. I promise I'll see you again, Kai. So where exactly do we go from here, Master Wu? Home. It's what we've been trying to do f from the very beginning. Let's get back home. So when exactly are you guys going to exactly tell us exactly what happened on the Earth that you were stranded on? Well, we'll tell you exactly what what happened ex like when we get back to our Earth. Alright. You know we'll see them again, right sis? Yes, Lloyd. I know we will. And besides, I made Kai a promise that I'll see him again. And I'm going to keep that promise. So you're still distraught over the destruction of your creation, Toa. Well, yes, my lord. But I do have to admit, it was Mira that was the cause of his own downfall. He was so determined to get his revenge, it led to his own downfall. But that's alright. I can always make another Mira. A Mira that's both powerful than both elemental masters and those mutants on Earth-1. I can make you better, Mira. A couple months later. Master Wu. I'm, I'm assuming that you must be the Supreme Kai of Time, correct? Yes, Wu. I had known your father back in the day, and he was a kind and wise man, I have to admit. I might want to add, you are correct on that part. But what really brings you to Ninjago? We're here with a warning. There's a war coming. And the inhabitants of this earth are only scratching the surface of the multiversal war. But it won't be long before your earth is dragged into the multiversal war. But I must ask, who else knows about this multiversal war? Most of Team Fazbiz, including you guys. You may have won the battle against Mira, but the multiversal war will soon eventually reach your Earth. So, you were beaten that easily too, by someone who isn't Sonic. Of course I was, that's what I was talking about, you idiot. Well, aren't you supposed to be the great Dr. Robotnik? Even though we're the same person, I see that our personalities do quite vary in the multiverse. I was beaten by some Robins, and you were beaten by a robot. 
How is that even fair with, with us? I suppose we should go and order some DoorDash, don't you think? Yes! I see that the benefits of this world include having our food delivered directly to us. Why do they actually do helicopter deliveries? I hope so, let me... how about we go and check? Oh, and can you give DoorDash me some, uh, some Jersey Mike's? I'm really looking for a sandwich.